Hi, this is Dr. Rajeshwar from YR Pharma Tube. In this video, we shall learn the metals and metal hydrides used in reduction reactions, which is one of the reactions of synthetic importance. Hydride in chemistry is said to be an anion of hydrogen that is H- and its molecular weight is 1.008 grams per mole. Hydride is any class of chemical compound in which hydrogen is combined with another element. Three types of hydrides are saline or ionic hydrides, metallic hydrides and covalent hydrides. They may be distinguished on the basis of types of chemical bond that is involved. For example, some of the most popular hydrides that covalently bound to hydrogen atoms are water, methane and ammonia. Water is a hydride of oxygen, methane is a hydride of carbon and ammonia is a hydride of nitrogen. Thus, hydride is a chemical compound where the hydrogen atoms exhibit nucleophilic, basic or reducing properties. Usually, in a hydride, the hydrogen has the oxidation number equal to minus 1. Metal hydrides are metals which have been bonded to hydrogen to form a new compound. Any hydrogen compound that is bonded to another metal element can effectively be called a metal hydride. Generally, the bond is covalent in nature, but some hydrides are formed from ionic bonds. The hydrogen has an oxidation number of minus 1. The metal absorbs the gas which forms the hydride. H plus is the hydronium ion and H minus is the hydride ion. The most common examples of metal hydrides include aluminium, boron, lithium borohydride and various salts. For example, aluminium hydrides include sodium aluminium hydride. There are also many more complex metal hydrides suitable for various uses. These complex metal hydrides are often soluble in ethanol solvents. These hydrides are generally insoluble being conductive. Thus, they are used for their heat storage, hydrogen storage and compressors capabilities. Metal hydrides as reducing agents. An organic compound is reduced by the addition of hydrogen. Reduction can be achieved by one of the following three mechanisms. Number one, catalytic hydrogenation. Number two, dissolving metal reduction. And number three, metal hydride reductions. All reducing agents provide the equivalent of two hydrogen atoms. Thus, the simplest reducing agent is molecular hydrogen. Reduction of this type that is catalytic hydrogenation are carried out in the presence of a metal catalyst that acts as a surface on which the reaction occurs. Carbon-carbon, carbon-nitrogen and some carbon-oxygen multiple bonds can be reduced by catalytic hydrogenation. The second one is to deliver hydrogens in a reduction that is to add two protons and two electrons to a substrate. Reducing agents of this type use alkali metals as a source of electrons and liquid ammonia as a source of protons. Thus, the reactions with sodium in ammonia are called dissolving metal reductions. For example, an alkyne is reduced by sodium and liquid ammonia to a trans alkene. Remember that the product of a reduction reaction has more carbon-hydrogen bonds than the reactant. The third one is to deliver the equivalent of two hydrogen atoms is to add hydride ion and a proton. The most common hydride reducing agents contain a hydrogen atom bonded to boron or aluminium. For example, sodium borohydride and lithium aluminium hydride. Metal hydride reagents act as a source of hydride ion because they contain polar metal hydrogen bonds that place a partial negative charge on nitrogen. For most laboratory scale reductions of aldehydes and ketones, catalytic hydrogenation has been replaced by methods based on metal hydride reducing agents. These agents deliver hydride ion to a substrate and then a proton is added from water or an alcohol. Lithium aluminium hydride is a stronger reducing agent than sodium borohydride. Sodium borohydride is used to reduce aldehydes, ketones and acyl halides while lithium aluminium hydride is used to reduce carboxylic acids, esters and amides. 
Replacing some of the hydrogens of lithium aluminum hydride with alkoxy groups decreases the reactivity of the metal hydride. Multiple bonded carbon atoms cannot be reduced by metal hydrides. This is the list of references followed for the lesson. That's all in this video, the metal hydride reduction. In the next video, we will discuss the two important metal hydride reducing reagents such as sodium borohydride and lithium aluminium hydride. Till then, never stop learning and never stop watching my videos. Thank you for watching this video.